WTFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading down 106, NASDAQ off 90, S&P's down 16. Gold, gold contract up $9.60, trading at 2,024 an ounce. We have silver up 53 cents, $23.48 an ounce, light sweet crude. Up a buck 11, $79.14 a barrel. Look at this copper market, man. 405 is that uh, structure that I'm looking for. Actually, it's 425. Up six and a half pennies, 382 a pound. Uh, notes and bonds, a 10 year note, down 14 ticks, trading out at uh, 109.23, the 30 year off 21 at 118.06 and King Dollar. King Dollar right now, trading down 11 ticks at 104.285. Euro 107, yen 150, British pound at 126 to 1 US dollar. We get over and take a look at the SPY. You're going to have a flat market out here, folks. You're coming into the holiday weekend. I'll show you on the futures for a second. But the SPY bottom line is that, you know, it's really been an inside day out here. You got to 502, you're at, you're at 500, 498 was the bottom. If we go take a look at the E mini, why, why do you see what the E mini just did? It's pretty cool what it just did. So, you always get, you know, high volume lows, higher volume highs. In this particular case, what we did, we just came to the high of the high volume low, and then it tested it the second time with dramatically lighter volume. So, the, the contract volume, 78,000 it was going into. The first one that came down hard was uh, 57, but then the next test out there was only 34. So this thing's going to try to basically probably get flat for the, for the day. That's how I'm figuring this thing. And then if we go over to the dollar, it's still all about the dollar. The dollar gave it up on price out here. Uh, the dollar was up uh, to 104, 672. Gave it up. Still not in the low, lower range, but uh, as soon as it gives it up, that gives the S&P room to breathe. We go to the gold contract. We take a look at gold. And uh, you know, it looks to me that you know we'll see whether we get the test of that low. But the gold contract looks like it was a blowout low to me. Uh, you know, you, you came down hard, you came down fast, you broke the swing point. Um, you didn't have a huge amount. We, you had an extension of volume, let's put it that way. You definitely had an extension of volume. That being said, we got more volume yesterday. You're inside the larger range right now. The larger range being, well, you're right close to it. Two, 2024 is the number, and we're at 2023. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.